to All right, guys, welcome back. So this is the last video for today. Um, as I mentioned in the other video before this, I am probably going to um, change my topic a bit with these videos. Um, I wanted to make this a very quick video, guys, because this is a hard one to explain because it's a long video. It's like two and a half hours. Um, well, the, the showcase is. It's not even a showcase, guys. All it is is basically Xbox uh, games. Um, so what they do is they talk about selected games, what they're doing, what type of games they are. Like, I think um, Age of Empires, for example, or um, Outer Scrolls. I think they talked about the um, World, World of Warcraft, this one particularly, which one I was actually more interested in. Considering I don't really play those multiplayer games, because they're just so, well, long, they take forever to finish. But yeah, um, but yeah, um, as, is, as I said, these ones are a bit more longer, because they do a lot more than just um, show a demo, talk about it for five seconds and move on. They're not like the future games um, process. This one, they do a little talk, they'll start bringing up the game, they'll put you in a, um, basically like an interview type of area, and they'll talk a lot about the game. I find these boring. Sorry guys, I don't, I know you guys quite enjoy these type of things, I don't. I feel like I'm just sitting there waiting for, um, I could be playing games or doing other projects on the side when, when they're doing this kind of stuff, because a lot of the time I just don't care about the, like, behind the scenes, or how they come up with certain things um things like that i'm more interested in the gameplay type of that guys where i love to get my hands on games give it a, tr a play if it, even if it's a demo or a, be a better beta things like that um give them a shot that's my that's my whole stick that's what i do but yeah that's what i think of these things guys so that's why i'm not too big into these like talking a lot um i'm not a big talker and this is something i have to work on i'm not really a social person I'm not saying i don't like talking to people or anything i just don't care about a lot of things uh a lot of people tend to be a Based on my experience, this crap. Um, not all of them. Not, I've got a few people on Discord I talk to with their beard. And people are talking streams and all that, and they're fine. They're, I've got no issue with them because they don't. They don't like constantly annoy me. They don't, you know, um, message me offline so much. Every so often, maybe, but nothing too bad. That's what I like about it, guys. So I can stream at my own pace and talk if I want to, and ignore people if I really want to. If I'm really in the mood. Um, but yeah, I'm not a big social person, guys. So I'm thinking tomorrow when we watch the Xbox Day Free one, which I think is the last one i am going to make more of an effort to um sit down and watch it guys i have like a, 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 an issue with um, watching things for long periods of time now it's not i don't have adhd or anything like that even though it might feel like that at the moment because my my attention spans really bad these days i used to be able to sit down like a union or that for two and a half hours no problem whatsoever these days i'll be lucky to sit down for three minutes without getting my phone out the real bad tendency and i recommend him not getting into it but either way it's just the way things are um guys but this one's a short one guys so tomorrow it's going to be a different one i'm going to try to do these videos like i do if i was streaming um so basically the process will be me talking at the beginning and every time a new game or the end of the game segment i'll talk about the what i watched and all that a bit more commentary type of thing so something something to give you guys values and stuff i might talk about i might get a game you know you know things that might be interesting so that's how i'm going to do things in the future guys uh, for this video i wasn't too excited about any games that maybe lord of the rings um lord of the rings what did i say lord of the rings not lord of the rings sorry wrong one um world of warcraft um i haven't played it for a very long time and i can't really install any games on this computer as i mentioned my hard drive space is so low it's not even funny i've got to go through the uh, computer at some point guys and start cleaning up all the junk that's scattered all over the place um probably start using one drive a bit more efficiently and put more things on there so i don't have to have it locally on my computer all the time and things like that so that's gonna be fun tomorrow i'll probably do that tomorrow after the xbox thing and yeah i hope you guys have a good day um like i said i'm gonna try different things in the coming up video so get, um if you uh don't really want it you can support me on you know youtube and all that i only do videos on here on youtube and facebook that's it and 
for Facebook uh, for future guys. I do put them. I do have a Minecraft channel and I do have a Let's Play channel on Facebook, Facebook as well. I was going to remove some of them, but a lot of people said recommend I just keep it how it is and do things why I, I think I should be done. So luckily for us guys, they're not disappearing. Um, I was thinking about cutting out the videos, but I realised Facebook doesn't really take that long to upload. I mean, it's a little bit slower than um, YouTube, but not by a lot. So yeah, I'll probably keep everything going there, guys. Everything will be pretty much the same. Um, all the um, like Twitch and all that will stay exactly the same. Nothing will change. I might change the names on certain things, but other than that, pretty much going to be exactly the same, guys. So that'll be the end of that conversation. You probably won't hear me talking about that. So you'll be seeing me on community talking about other things, games. Uh, TCGs. It's going to be a lot of games related stuff, guys, and unboxing, maybe unboxings and shit like that. So yeah, I'm happy with where we are going, guys. I mean, I could get a bit more, um, and more subscribers. I only got 117 on this play channel. And considering this channel is the oldest one out of the three I got. Ironically, guys, the Minecraft one's just newest, and the Let's Plays is the second newest. Well, actually, technically made it the same day. Well, it's only a few hours difference, but yeah. Um, an hey, if you guys can help out, right? I'll be good. Um, I do have a Patreon in the in the description now, guys. Once this channel gets to a point where I can start doing things like um, you know, I can do start doing payment things through um YouTube. That's when I'll probably start getting rid of Patreon. Patreon's a good way to get started with things, but I don't want to get to a situation when I get bigger and keep Patreon because there'll be nothing Patreon does that I can't do on YouTube. Um, a lot of things I can do on you, I can do on YouTube with Patreon, but I can't do that one on starting up. So Patreon it is. Um, so you can go on there and give me support, guys, or help me support or whatever you want to face. Now I don't charge a ridiculous amount or anything. I don't think any of my things is over five bucks, or maybe ten. I can't remember the pricing, but I don't. I think for the most part it's under five dollars. I keep it um, cheap because I think it's just the best way to do it, guys. Like a little bit of money means I can get a bit more people in there, and maybe we can do more things. That's the idea, guys. I did get a bit off track, off topic with these sound videos because I can do that a bit sometimes. Because if I don't, the video is going to be like two minutes long, and I'll be finished. Oh yeah, that's how I do things, guys. Um, I'll give you a heads up with Patreon. I do upload the games early on on there. So we do the cheapest one. You got the free, free one, and you got the two pay ones. Any of the two pay ones, you'll get access to those videos pretty much straight away. So that could be about a day, one or two days early. So if you are interested in that, go for it. Um, I might do some extra videos on Patreon, just behind the scenes, um, some stupid stuff, you know, things like that. Um, I might be doing more shorts in the future as well. On that note, guys, I think we'll leave it here, because I don't want to get too sidetracked. Like I already have, I already wasted six minutes talking about it, so fantastic. Um, but yeah, guys, I hope tomorrow I'll be able to sit down and watch these videos and get ideas. I've got my notebook with me, guys. I finally got a notebook. For this type of thing, so I can start writing things down that's a bit more interesting to me. Um, I can write down the timestamps and shit like that, you know, get a bit more motivated to do these videos for you. Then, day guys, I do these videos for you, not so much for myself. Uh, I like doing these videos, so yeah, like I said, guys, I'm gonna keep doing this type of stuff. I'll probably get better as time goes on. I will be doing my vlogs, vlogs, what do you want to call them? Every probably about three times a week, maybe three or four times, maybe three times a week. Maybe I'll do the same, a vlog on the um, stream day just for fun, and we can do a bit of a quick wrap up. Like I can do the stream first, and then I can do the vlog afterwards, just explain what we did and all that. Or maybe I'll just use the um, stream and cut out parts of it that you know can be boring and just use that as a vlog. Maybe it's more add-ons. So, yeah, there's a lot of ideas, guys. Now, let me know in the comments what you guys want would like to do in the future. Um, so, yeah, um, I'll, if you want me to do more reactions to these type of things, let me know, because I would love to see what your opinion is and see what we can do to grow together, guys. Cheers.